वेलकम बिफोर स्टार्टिंग विथ टेक्निकल क्वेश्चन सीरीज बी रेडी फॉर बिलो थ्री क्वेश्चन दैट आर वेरी कॉमनली आज क्वेश्चन वन टेल मी अबाउट यूर सेल्फ और इंट्रोड्यूस यूर सेल्फ क्वेश्चन नंबर टू वाई डू यू वॉन्ट टू वर्क विथ आवर कंपनी क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री वाई डू यू वॉन्ट टू लेफ्ट यूर करंट कंपनी फर्स्ट टेक्निकल क्वेश्चन वॉट इज रोल ऑफ पैकिंग ऑपरेटर और सीनियर ऑपरेटर इन द फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्री आंसर इज पैकिंग ऑपरेटर्स मैनेज पैकेजिंग इक्विपमेंट मॉनिटर फॉर डिफेक्ट्स परफॉर्म बेसिक ट्रबल शूटिंग एंड एंश्योर इफिशियंट ऑपरेशन टू मीट प्रोडक्शन टारगेट्स वॉट आर द की पैकेजिंग मशीनरी इन फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्री द की पैकेजिंग मशीनरीज और इक्विपमेंट्स इन द फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्री आर ब्रिस्टर पैकिंग मशीन स्ट्रिप पैकिंग मशीन कार्टनिंग मशीन बॉटल फिलिंग मशीन ट्यूब फिलिंग मशीन सैशेट पैकिंग मशीन लेबलिंग मशीन श्रिंक रैपिंग मशीन केस पैकिंग मशीन एंड सीलिंग मशीन एक्सप्लेन द प्रोसेस ऑफ लाइन क्लियरेंस बिटवीन बैचेस टू प्रिवेंट क्रॉस कंटेमिनेशन स्टेप वन रिमूवल ऑफ प्रीवियस बैच मटेरियल स्टेप टू थरो क्लीनिंग एंड इंस्पेक्शन एंड स्टेप थ्री डॉक्यूमेंटेशन एंड अप्रूवल what are the safety precautions to be taken while operating packing line equipments the few important safety precautions that should be considered while operating packing line equipments are do not touch moving parts do not touch hot surfaces avoid overloading of the machine do not bypass safety guards turn off power before maintenance report fault immediately avoid using damaged tools or equipment do not operate without training and stay alert how to handle packing machine spare parts which are not in use you can refer below table for handling guidelines for packing machine spare parts which are not in use these are store in designated areas protect from dust and moisture follow manufacturer's guidelines avoid mixing with unusable parts regularly inspect and do inventory what are frequently occurring packaging machine breakdowns and corrective actions you can refer below table for breakdown issue cause and corrective action the commonly observed breakdown issues are film or blister packing material jamming sealing failure sensor malfunction frequent machine stops conveyor belt slipping product feeding issues and printing or labeling errors what is role of operator training or importance of packing operator training proper training to operators ensure skills to handle machinery effectively reduce downtime and improving productivity what is importance of machine changeover in packaging line here are the five important points for machine changeover in packaging line first ensure complete removal of previous batch material second install correct change parts third verify machine setting and calibration fourth clean and sanitize equipment thoroughly and fifth conduct line clearance what is serialization in pharmaceutical packaging serialization is unique identification codes for each product to track its journey through the supply chain what is track and trace system in pharmaceutical packaging track and trace is a serialization based system in pharmaceutical packaging that integrates unique identifiers example gs1 barcodes 2d matrix codes etc and aggregation data what is proof checking in pharmaceutical packaging procedure proof checking in pharmaceutical packaging is the process of verifying critical details such as batch number expiry dates and product codes on packaging materials what kind of market complaints can be raised due to packaging error the packaging errors which can lead to market complaints are incorrect labeling seal integrity issues missing or incorrect inserts damaged packaging or mismatched product and packaging how to respond to spills or leaks of hazardous materials during packaging operations immediately stop the operation contain the spill using appropriate absorbent material wear proper ppe that is personal protective equipments clean the area following the spill management sop and dispose of waste as per hazardous material guidelines what are the different types of packaging materials used in pharmaceutical industry blister packs bottles ampules and vials tubes these are used as primary packaging cartons labels inserts or leaflets used in secondary packaging corrugated boxes shrink wraps and pallets 
are used in tertiary packaging. What are the daily activities of packing operator in pharmaceutical industry? Planning and coordination, packing line clearance and setup, monitoring packing line operations, quality checks and documentation, compliance and regulatory requirements, inventory and material management, training and team supervision, equipment maintenance and troubleshooting are the daily activities of packing operator in pharmaceutical industry. What are the key components of a batch packing record that is BPR? Batch information, material codes, line clearance, packing process details, machine and equipment details, quality control checks, signature and approvals and yield calculations are the key components of a batch packing record or BPR. Explain the use of blister pack versus strip pack. You can refer bullet table for various features of blister pack and strip pack. Blister pack holds individual pockets containing product sealed with plastic or aluminum film, whereas strip pack packaging is done with two layers of foil or film sealed around each unit. How do you handle line clearance in packing? Ensure that all materials, documents and products from the previous batch are removed from the packing area. Clean and sanitize the packing line and equipments. Verify and document the cleared status of the line ensuring readiness for the next batch with appropriate labels and approvals from quality assurance that is QA. What is temper evident packaging and why is it used? Temper evident packaging is a type of packaging designed to show visible signs if it has been opened or altered. It is used to prevent consumers by ensuring product integrity and safety. What is deviation, change control and kappa? Deviation is an unplanned event or departure from established procedures, processes or specifications in pharmaceutical operations. Whereas change control is a systematic approach for managing modifications to processes, procedures, equipment or documents to ensure they do not negatively impact product quality. Whereas kappa or corrective and preventive actions is a process to identify, address and prevent the recurrence of issues or deviations that impact product quality or compliance. How do we handle deviations during packing process? We handle deviations during the packing process by documenting the issue, investigating the root cause and implementing corrective and preventive actions that is kappa to prevent recurrence that is repeat occurrence. How do you manage the storage of packaging materials? We manage the storage of packaging materials by organizing them in designated areas with controlled temperature and humidity following FIFO that is first in first out to maintain material quality. We also ensure regular inventory checks to avoid shortages or excess stock. What precautions are taken when packing moisture sensitive products? Use of desiccants, moisture proof packaging materials, controlled humidity in packing area, primary packaging seals and secondary packaging are the few precautions that are taken while packing of moisture sensitive products. How do you manage rejected materials during the packing process? Rejected materials are segregated and labeled to prevent use followed by investigation and documentation of the cause. They are then either reworked returned or disposed of according to company's procedure. What measures are taken to prevent mix-ups on the packing line? Clear labeling and segregation, barcode scanning, standard operating procedures that is SOPs and regular training and audits are the measures that are taken to prevent mix-ups on the packing line. Basic but important what is difference between primary packaging and secondary packaging? You can refer below table for various aspects of primary packaging and secondary packaging. Primary packaging comes into direct contact with the pharmaceutical product ensuring its integrity and protection. Whereas secondary packaging surrounds and protects the primary packaging providing additional protection during storage, transportation and dispensing. What is the importance of documenting environmental conditions during packing? Documenting environmental conditions like temperature, humidity and cleanliness 
ensure compliance with quality standards. It helps to maintain product integrity, preventing contamination or degradation. What are the recent advancements in the pharmaceutical packaging? Smart packaging, sustainable materials, personalized packaging, nanotechnology and 3D printing are the recent advancements in the pharmaceutical packaging. Which guidelines are commonly referred in packing department in pharmaceutical industry? Good manufacturing practices that is GMP, good documentation practices that is GDP, USFDS 21 CFR part 211, European Union GMP Udralex volume 4 and ICHQ 10 that is pharmaceutical quality system are the commonly referred guidelines in the pharmaceutical industry for packing department. Don't forget to like, comment and share. Subscribe to channel for more videos related to our pharmaceutical industry.